Well, welcome back my gardening friends to a carrot in a bottle. So I think it was under the uh, hashtag uh, carrot uh, in a bottle challenge. Uh, it was started by uh, Haughty uh, Hugo, uh, Hugh. Uh, he hasn't uh, been about for a while, but like everyone else, very busy. He hasn't done many uploads, but he's done a few changes. So go and pay, uh, pay him a visit. And basically it was, uh, growing a carrot in a bottle so basically I, I've had some sort of uh, watering system some way of actually holding it uh, upright oh hello sorry disturbed uh, the moth's sleep and this one now uh, is really looking a little bit um, sad uh, I can see a bit of a root there it doesn't look like it's supposed to be in the right place uh, something there and uh, maybe the drain holes weren't big enough but it has dried out a little bit soon does in this uh, warm but let's uh, have a little look and always inspect your plants before you do anything one of our lady ladybug friends whoops good day so let's uh, take it out and have a look now this one was one from a transplant, so we've actually taken it out of the ground on a thinnings when we've done the thinnings. So it uh, be interesting to see what it actually looks like. Now, if you damage the roots, they'll fork. Uh, so this will be very interesting. I've had to take it, stop, because I wasn't sure whether I could get it out or not. probably looking a little bit sad because um, it really there's no nutrients is there nothing at all uh, so uh, let's have a look I might have to give it a wash I'm going to spoil it Well, there we go. One of those nice, interesting carrots. So we've got uh, five legs on that. So I've done some more transplants of carrots uh, in the polytunnel raised bed. So it'd be interesting to see what that happens. But you can see what's happened. You pull the plant out. This will bulb up, and then this is what happens if you plant your carrots into rocky soil where it hits a stone and then it uh, forks out. Or it may be. This compost was far too rich because it's decided that the nutrients at the top and this is where it throws uh, the legs out very similar to parsnips so let's give this a bit of a wash to make it look pretty right I think I'll give it a bit of a wash too hard um, there's a bit of green on it but that's the one that I think was at the edge of the container so that's got a bit of algae on it but there's no other damage as I can see and uh, I've had to control myself guys because uh, I lifted the lid on the uh, nettle tea and nearly um, washed it in that now uh, that would have been something wouldn't it explaining to Mrs K why she hasn't got a carrot for a tea well there again if I'd have scrubbed it hard enough she perhaps wouldn't have noticed but anyway hashtag carrot in a bottle challenge 2019 go and pay Haughty Hugo uh, a visit and if you hit the hashtag you'll see all the other videos and all the other participants now why not go and have a look at their channels they're there you might find uh, an, a channel that you're interested in Saves you keep coming to watch me. I like it. Very good. That's a real good uh, explanation of a carrot that's uh, not grown properly. Hope you found that useful. Certainly been an interesting challenge. And like I said, there's lots of other great channels out there that have uh, done this um, bit of a challenge. 
and uh, go and see what uh, how they've done theirs. I haven't. I think mine might be the first reveal because mine was looking a bit sad, but you can probably see why. Happy gardening to you all. Till next time, my friends. Ta-ra for now.